smile birdies you're on YouTube Let's see if we can see in the wildlife. We can zoom in a minute. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. da. Oh yeah. Wow. Right there, man. That is beautiful. Show about that quick pan. Yeah, guys, fall is here. All right, y'all. So here, y'all, y'all. All right. So here's the update on the weather. Tomorrow is supposed to be rainy, and Wednesday is supposed to be partly sunny. And 38. There's a weather update, folks. Hey guys, it's Trish. It's Tuesday night, the night before my surgery. Um, today it snowed a little. <laughs> um, it's something, it started to snow about about right after lunchtime, I would say 12.15ish. So, um, the kids were coming back for lunch and, you know, they're walking down the hall going, it's snowing! I'm like looking out the window and I continued to do what I had to do. And, um, my boss had me leave 10 minutes early because uh, he didn't know what the roads were like. I like Who's to argue, you know, he wished me good luck and all, and yeah, so getting home was no problem, you know, but, uh, you know, it's good to, you know, know people looking out for your uh, well-being, you know, and uh, got home, um, did my eye drops, uh, had some tea, um, <laughs> Then I uh, I took a little siesta, and when I woke up, the sun was setting, and it was just a beautiful red, you know, yellow. It was a beautiful sky, and um, you could see it on uh, my Facebook page and my Instagram page. It it it, it was remarkable. All right, guys, well, I'll talk to you tomorrow. And uh, uh, tell you how I feel and all that. Okay. Hey guys, it's me. Um. Well, the surgery went better than I thought. Um, I wasn't as nervous. Oh, I, I, I mean, I. I mean, if I was nervous, it was maybe on a scale of a 1.1, 1, 1 .1. you know, I was hardly nervous at all, you know, when I got there. 
There were a few people that had a maid that were in and out of there in like 50 minutes. And uh, I like, okay, so this can't be bad, right? Yeah, so it went well. Um, copy your easy, go easy with these soon. The reason I'm not wearing my glasses is um, I need a new prescription in that that one lens and uh you know i don't wear my glasses i could see better at, out of this eye than i can out of this eye it's weird anyway today i ordered a salad from hickory hog yep there it is and now i'm gonna make a cup of tea so a big shout out to Hickory Hog and all my buddies at Bayhead School. Um, you know, I got that uh, balloon and I got a uh, nice card which I'll show you in a minute. And I got a uh, a little uh, care package from Muller, uh, uh, Muller's Bakery Treats, which can, uh, has uh, contained uh, two uh, Blue Bay Muffin and a... Um, Hey, uh, a <coughs> piece of crumb cake. All right, more in a minute. Oh, and here's my eye. No more cataract, folks. No more cataract. And sorry for the little spit there. No more cataract. All right, so, um... Yeah, the procedure was not not bad at all. It really wasn't. And uh, the surgery wasn't bad at all. I might have been in and out in 20, 30 minutes max, right? So we're all sitting there, you know, and there's this guy that went in there in front of me and Right before I went in, he came out, and um, and uh, his daughter or whoever was with him said, "Come on, sit down, sit down, relax." He goes, "No, I want to go dancing," and he's you know making these like dance moves. I'm like, "Okay, I am," you know. He's like moving his arms and stuff, like you know how you you know. When you go to do a slow dance, you reach your arms out to grab your partner and like, <sighs> okay, I have nothing to worry about, right? So I'm sitting there and like 15 minutes go to out guy and this other, um, no, I think there's a woman that came out after him before I went in and she was like, she was like in a wheelchair and so she wasn't well with they wheeled her out in a wheelchair and uh she's like oh, i got my cane i got my cane and she's giving the nurse a little bit of a hard time she goes you gotta trust me and you know just help me guide you and stuff i'm like okay we got the guy that wanted to go dance and then we got her <laughs> all right so <clears throat> you know, there was this guy coming in and out, uh, you know, you know, um, uh, I guess a doctor's assistant or whatever. His name was Andrew, and he was a he was a prep guy, right? So he came out. He said, "Patricia, he took my hand and led me into the prep room, and you know." Um, put this, you know, these things, this thing over my shoes and this gown over me and, you know, uh, put this cap on me and stuff. And then he led me into the surgery room, which wasn't as, as scary as the one I went when I got that um, weird growth uh, off my leg. I was, you know, it wasn't as scary as that one, but it was, 
you know, it was just like this big black leather chair, you know, and doctor's chair, whatever. So I was like, oh, so this is a surgery room. He goes, yes, this is a surgery room. So I got in there, and then there was this doctor, and he, oh, no, well, then we went to the other room. Well, they call it a pre preparation room. And this doctor came in and goes, I'm going to give you some anesthesia. And he, you know, he, he stuck like this, uh, what do they call it, IV scent or whatever it is in there. And I felt a little good. He goes, no, don't move. I said, I know. <laughs> you know, I'm like, I should not, I should be immune to needle pain. But now I didn't say that. But I'm thinking, why am I still feeling the pain of needles at this point? So, so he, he he put the stent in there. I'm looking at it, going, wait a minute, thinking, wait a minute. I thought it's gonna be a week for this procedure, but what it was is just you know medicine to, you know, calm you down and relax you. It wasn't like anesthesia, general anesthesia, you know, where it puts you out. I like, oh man, I'm gonna be so flippin' loopy when I walk out of here. <laughs> and uh so they walk me into the operating room and they're putting all these cloths and you know, stra st strapping me down. I'm going, Oh my gosh, here we go and I said, Okay, Trish I'm thinking, Okay, Trish and the doctor's talking to me, okay, look this way, don't, you know, relax and all this. And, and you know, I couldn't see anything, but I heard a lot. I heard, mm -hmm. I, then, like, I didn't feel pain, but I felt pressure, something going in my eye. That was the uh, implant. And my I like trying to keep my eyes open, and she go, and I of course I guess she touched a muscle or something, and I just squinted, and she goes, oh don't squint, don't squint. I think I'm sorry, I can't help it. She goes, do you feel pain? I said no, I just feel pressure, you know. But uh, you know, and after that was done i sat up i was like oh i could see i could not very well but i could see no more cataract or something and uh it was uh, not bad at all you know um yeah um so uh i i went out and um, sat down, and they gave me these dark glasses. We all, glasses that we're all looking like red shells, and they get out in there. And uh, <coughs> yeah, and um, no disrespect, Ray. Sorry, I didn't mean that in a disrespectful way, but you know. And then I came home, and I. I slept most of the afternoon when I got home. Well, when I get home, like three, maybe three, four o'clock, and I slept till like six. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that was it. All right, guys. So, uh, let's see how, how let's see how much I uh, have a left uh, uh how by minutes so i went on gabbing and then uh on to the next thing maybe oh yeah guys so uh yesterday um i t got a text um from a school nurse well actually it was a message on instagram saying that uh there was something on the at my, on my door so uh I got this nice card from the folks at work. Oh, mm. and I got this balloon. Look at that. And a box that had, like I said, 
and the balloon and the card were attached to this box which has a, a blue bay muffin on it. Originally I had two blue, blue bay muffins and a piece of crumb cake. But I ate the crumb cake after lunch tomorrow, yesterday. Yeah, I ate the crumb cake after lunch yesterday. And, um, and I ate, had the blue bay muffin after, for dessert last night. So, um, I'm debating on whether to have that blue bay muffin uh, now or later. What the heck, life is short. I'll have it now. All right, guys, well, that's it for me. And this is Trish signing off saying peace, love, and keep the good tunes spinning. Take care and take care of each other. Be good. And be good to each other. I hope everyone had a great week. I may have another video, um, but uh, it may be a two-parter today, okay? Okay. Later.